Good morning, guys. It's Tuesday. It's Tired Tuesday. So I actually had to go drop off Charlie this morning. That was a change of pace because Eddie's doing the election. He got up at like 3.30 and I had to get up at 5.15. So but I went and dropped off Charlie and now I'm at work and I just want to go to sleep. But I do have a double shot waiting for me in there. So I want to go get that. So I'm walking down to this church down here because I'm going to vote for the very first time in my entire life. Yeah, so it just happens to be right around the corner and that's where I'm going to vote. Go out and vote if you haven't. Can you hear the bells chiming on this church up here? Chime, chime, chime. That's the building I'm going to right there. It's just literally right around the block. Guess what guys? I voted. Do you see the sticker? I voted. This is kind of fun. I don't know why I do this more when I was growing up. I had like two other chances. Just cause so many people told me growing up that I had to vote, like they were like, you have to. And I was just like, I don't like people telling me what I have to do, you know? I don't know, I was just, I kind of rebelled against it. And I didn't really understand the full impact of like not voting and such, so. But I voted this time, yay! Except I didn't realize you had to vote on so many things. I mean, I thought it was just like president. And that was it. But no, you got like all these secretaries and senators and judges. The judges. That was the one that got me. I was like, I don't know any of these people. But, and then amendments. Which that was pretty easy. But it was fun. I look forward to doing it again in another four years. <laughs> well, while I'm out, I'm going down to Quick Trip to get me a cappuccino for National Cappuccino Day. Grandpa's watching Charlie, by the way. Because Eddie's working. Cappuccino, I'm coming for you, for you. Okay, I got my cappuccino. I'm not taking a drink of it while I'm walking though. I'll burn my lips. It's actually a French vanilla. They had a cookies and cream one, but I was like, I'm not in the mood for that. Okay, I have my cappuccino. Yes, he's watching the Supernatural parody again. I had to calm him down. Grandpa was here, we were trying to talk and he was crying. But anyway. Is it, and this has been sitting there for like 10 minutes, so it's probably cooler now. But happy National Cappuccino Day. Yeah, it's a lot cooler. <laughs> Didn't burn my tongue. Mm. I haven't had a cappuccino in a long time. It's really good. Shake, shake, shake. Shake me He loves it. He loves it. Hopefully he actually loves the show Supernatural just as much as I do. Won't you, Charlie? Is that your show? Cracking up, kid. I love him. Yes, yes, yes. I forgot to end the vlog last night. Blah. But it was just a weird night. Eddie didn't get home till about 9:30, and then Charlie woke up, like, cause he heard him or something. And so Charlie was awake for a while, and then we were talking about who's gonna win the presidency. By the way, spoiler alert. <laughs> no, Donald Trump. Everybody knows it. He's gonna be our next president, Donald freaking Trump. Even though, yeah, I voted for him, but it's because I felt like he was the lesser of two evils. But still, I'm worried for our country now. But anyway, uh, that cappuccino was really good. And I'm not sure what I'm doing for today's national day yet, or tomorrow, whatever, whatever you want. Anyway, um, I'll figure it out. Let me see you guys then. Okay, I have broken. Sorry. I have broken off a giant piece this um, dark 